It's a fall thrift haul, y'all. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself, it rhymes. Um, hey, it's Lauren, welcome to my channel. Welcome, welcome to my living room. I went to a couple different stores and I'm excited to show you everything I got. Of course, my neighbor decides to start landscaping. I ventured out into the world safely with my mask and my gloves and my hand sanitizer on the ready. And I went out looking for things that I was missing in my wardrobe um, that I was excited to find for fall. Neutrals and pops of blue. That's a truck. Anyway, let's get to the rack. So first up, I found this raincoat. I'm super excited about it because I live in LA and fall and winter to me means rain. Uh, this is from Macy's, originally $48. This is a great little jacket. I think it's 80s. While I was checking out, I had not one, but two old ladies come up to me and say, what a great find. So I agree. This is a 1950s LBD. I got it because the, hold please. The label is Shannon Rogers for Jerry Silverman. So Shannon Rogers was a renowned costume designer who teamed up with Jerry Silverman to create like a ready to wear line that was in department stores. This is a great little black dress. I'll probably get it stitched up and um, dry cleaned and put it in my shop. This is a Betsy Johnson dead stock. Here's the tag. Next, I found this really cute 90s Jessica Howard blazer. My neighbor's watching me. Hi. So I think I'm gonna get this cleaned and add it to the shop because I have a, a blazer drop coming soon. Next, this really great vintage blouse. Super excited about the high collar. There's some gold threading throughout. Next, I found two LBDs for me. I'm gonna, um, have this shortened, but I really liked this one. I really am into the little squiggle lines. I thought it gave a really great pop of personality to an otherwise simple sort of uh, slip dress. And then this fun 80s black and white polka dot, a print that'll never go out of style. And this one in particular reminded me of uh, Diane Keaton. And it also made me think of Julia Roberts in Pretty Woman where she wore that brown and, and white polka dot dress. Next, I found this really great blouse. It reminds me of like 2000s, does 1940s, uh, super SJP vibes. So I had to find some sequins. So I found these two. This one I'm gonna, again, add to the shop. This will be for sale at some point. I just wanna get her nice and cleaned for you and uh, this one I'm super excited about because honestly I've wanted one of these butterfly sequin tops since I was like a teenager. Also, uh, pro tip, my favorite time to go thrifting is around Halloween because all of the thrift stores put out what they consider a costume and that's where I found this. But honey, this ain't a costume. Holy moly, I found these leather brown pants with these really cool angular pockets. A lot of times I don't even try things on when I'm thrifting because I'm in a hurry. Here's another pro tip. If you uh, if you're at a thrift store or a flea market or don't want to deal with the dressing room, you take uh, the waist and you put it around your <laughs> you put it around your neck and that is the size of your waist. So if you could if you could hit tip to tip like this around your neck, the pants will fit your waist. I really lucked out with these. Ugh, they're my new babies. I'm gonna wear them every day. Next, I found a really great 80s um, duster sort of sweater, a long sweater. I love these because I throw them over anything in the fall and I live in LA and this can also act as a little jacket. Quick story about this. I found one in red at an estate sale that I passed on and you, have you ever like, passed on something that you know you could never go back and get and lose sleep over it, but just me. And so I'm really thrilled that I found basically the same sweater in blue. You guys ready for accessories? Well, great hats for fall because it's one of my favorite accessories. I feel like it's a great outfit topper. It's a really quick and easy way to, you know, elevate your outfit. Been looking at a lot of uh, Vivian Westwood and I feel like this one is got a cool shape to it that I haven't seen in a while. This is a vintage hat. I feel like this could be worn super cash with a t-shirt and jeans or whatever. Um, actually looking at this rack, 
I would put it with this blouse and those leather pants. Oh, I'm so excited. This really cool vintage hat. Um, and it fits my little noggin. Fun fact about me, I have a very small dome. Um, it's hard to find hats that I'm not swimming in. And this one, I loved the color. This cute little bag. Do you see the little roses on there? Ooh, shoes. I found these two pairs at Crossroads and it's the same Italian designer, same size foot. I guarantee it was the same uh, donor that dropped these off and I got lucky, snagged them. I found these Sam and Libby loafers. I love loafers for fall. Look, never worn, 90s Sam and Libby dead stock. I'm gonna wear the shit out of them. These are black Ferragamo, made in Italy. Um, they always remind me of my grandmother, so I couldn't pass them up. And I also loved that it's like a classic pump, but I love this little strap, giving it sort of that Mary Jane look. Ah, oh, I just noticed the heel on this is missing. Damn it, I'm gonna have to repair them. Oh well, they're still fun. I also picked up a few items for my house. I love a thrifted home. All about creating the space that's the most you through antiques or thrifted items or flea market finds. So without further ado, check out this puppy. Ooh, you hear that? Okay. Next, are you ready for this? No, oh, here we go. Oh, squiggle vase. Look at how fun that is. And it came with sticks. So <laughs> I needed help going to my car. Uh, so an employee helped me carry all this stuff. And as he's loading this into my trunk, he goes, good thing you found those old sticks. And I said, you know what? That's exactly what my fiance is gonna say when I get home. Lazy Susan, look at her spin. Put all my little apps on here. Voila. I got a stool. That about does it. That is my fall thrifted finds. Thanks so much for watching. Um, I'm so excited about these finds. I already have ideas of how I wanna style up these looks specifically. So I'm probably gonna put together some outfits and share them to my feed. So check them out there. And if you see me in IRL, just pretend like um, you're surprised and you've never seen any of this before. So uh, thanks for watching. See you next time. Mwah.